I'm gonna be doing a brand new reaction deal. Before anyone starts, I do want to say, I'm not at my not at my home right now. I'm not, I'm at my mom's house for the holidays, for Christmas. Well, you guys know what I'm saying. So, so yeah. And today, the reaction film we're going to do is from Sack Attack. Attack. A video of his like, a couple of 12 days ago. And the video of his I'm going to react to is called Burger King Shroom and Swiss Melt Review. So yeah, I'm going to react to it. So now, without further ado, let's get the video right now. And I do apologize for the upstairs noise. So without so further ado, let's get to it right now. I'm here to try the new Shroom and Swiss Melt. Shrooms? Cheesy tots. Let's see. Hey, it's Tina Burke. Hey, what are you doing? Can I get for you? I have a mobile pickup order for Zach. Go ahead and pull forward to me. Thank you. Oh, no worries. Have a good one. It's time to go try it out. Today, we're checking out Burger King's new... <laughs> So all the melts are back. They got the classic one. I think there's a bacon one. But today we're checking out the new one, which is the Shroom and Swiss Melt. This burger is going to feature two Walford Jr. patties, along with some sauteed mushrooms, two slices of Swiss cheese, and, of course, two toasted buns. The Zachary sauce one uh, description on the site also says boil sauce. Um, either way, I think it's actually the same thing. It's honestly kind of odd. Like, you know, it's a circle. <laughs> I guess that's pretty unique to this melt from Burger King. It's a like a circle bun. The shroom melt was actually tested a few years ago in a couple uh, like select markets, so as a, as a test run. So it's not completely new. This is my first time trying it, Ellie. So speaking about all these melts, uh, go ahead and melt that like button down below. This burger is 640 calories. The price for the burger alone is five dollars and forty nine cents. If you get a small combo, it's going to be eight dollars and ninety nine cents. Got a deal on the app called the Meltiest Melt. Or one, no, that's not it. The meltiest meal of the year. That includes a uh, melt of your choice, cheesy tots, a small fry, and a small drink. That is nine dollars and ninety nine cents. So, uh, kind of a good deal. Uh, I mean, if you break down the total savings for that, it's about like two dollars and seventy cents. So it's like a free small fry or smees, uh, it's me, <laughs> or a free small drink. They have a couple deals that you can get. You also have them with uh, with uh, a soda, melt, and uh, ice cream. So I was kind of tempted to do that, but I really wanted to try the melt, and some cheesy tots. Now it's time to see if this melt is picture perfect. Let's go ahead and get that picture up here. Okay, there we go. Um, so yeah, we're going to be looking for the mushrooms, of course, and the cheese, and the patties. Looks like I might have it upside down. I don't know. Yeah, the cheese is all kind of going this way. We're seeing the mushrooms for sure. Uh, we're seeing the uh, pieces of Swiss there. It's actually, like, really close to the picture. Uh, the bun, or the, the patty, the, the bread, the toast. Huh looks really uh, similar to the picture as well. I will say though, this is a lot smaller than I was imagining. I don't know why I thought it was gonna be a little bit bigger. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a little bit on the smaller side for a burger. And there it goes. <laughs> and just a quick 360 for you all too. I'm gonna give this one an A. Got my Dr. Pepper here. And got some fries here. The fries from Burger King are pretty mediocre. I wish I could have swapped it out for something else. Uh, but anyways. Oh, all right, and then some cheesy tots. This is the first time I'm actually going to be trying them out, so let's see. Oh, yeah. Whoa, what in the world? They actually, I, this is supposed to come with a four-piece. <laughs> they actually gave me six pieces. Awesome. <laughs> all right, cool. The cheesy tots are uh, pretty much just a tater tot with cheese inside of it, so uh, <laughs> nothing too uh, original there. Let's see how it tastes. pretty creamy and like kind of kind of cheesy but i i showed you the inside of it and you didn't see any of the cheese that it kind of looks like in the description of the picture that they show it could be good with some dipping ranch but they're okay four pieces like 150 so uh just to try them one time get them if you're really interested and you really love tater tots you might really like it they're better than the fries <laughs> at least i can say that much in the end they're okay this is quite a messy uh melt if i could say so man Pretty uh, messy. Dang, they really doused this thing and huh. that uh, stacker or royal sauce, whichever whichever one it is. But man, they really poured that stuff on here. Huh. We see all of the mushrooms there. Huh. Not a ton of mushrooms, to be honest, either. Maybe like five, six. Attempt to... Huh. Nope, I'm not even going to separate it. But you can clearly see it's just cheese in the middle of that. So the mushrooms are on that top bun. And then the other side. 
is just the toes and that bun. So pretty simple. Swiss patties, mushrooms, toast, sauce. That's it. <laughs> Looks like this is a good spot to go in for. You get everything. You got mushrooms taken out. You got the cheese, patties, of course the bread and some sauce. There, good amount of sauce right there. Let's go on for the attack. And there is a cross section for you all to see. All right, that sauce is just like I said, I was kind of worried about that, but that sauce is just taking over this whole thing. The flavor is really weak with the mushrooms. You get a really strong smell of the mushrooms kind of too, but then when you take a bite of it, it's just kind of flavorless. If you're looking for a strong flavor of mushrooms, it just isn't there. Uh, even the patties, like the patties flavor, you know, it, they're kind of flavorless, you know, they're Whopper patties. The consistency is pretty nice, you know, you get cheesiness you got the little pop from the mushrooms it kind of tastes like they buttered the toast a little bit not what i'm used to in a melt you know i've had I, I really love mushroom burgers this just really isn't it you know actually now that i'm thinking about it it may just be lacking some salt the flavor is just kind of not there it's so hard for me to explain what this tastes like because it's just kind of blah it's bland i would definitely opt for a different flavor if i were to try one of these again <laughs> But no, this is just, it's just not there. Quite disappointed. Everything's cooked right, right at least, you know. It's mm. blah. <laughs> Bland. I'm going to rate the shroom and Swiss melt from Burger King. I'm going to rate it a 4.5. Everything oh. is cooked right. The texture is okay, but the flavor, it's just, something's missing here. Something is really missing here. And they, they, they probably should have added something, another mm. element to this, maybe mm. some like uh, sauteed onions would have helped this as well. A little below average. I wouldn't get this again, so... It is what it is. All right, thanks so much for watching, and I'll see you on the next one. So, yeah, that's the end of the video. And I hope you guys like this race, but I hope you guys like it. And I hope you guys do like If you don't, then I don't care. And don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those notifications bell on. Every time I upload. And share my videos, and reacts videos, and other videos I do my channel to your friends, but you also you want your choice because I am making it. So yeah, and don't forget to subscribe to Sack Attack if you're new. Subscribe to your channel if you're new. Subscribe yet? Subscribe, subscribe if you're new. And on the main channel here, we're on the road to 3K subscribers. And on the back of the channel, to be joining 2.0, we're on the road to 100 subscribers. So yeah, and that's the inspiration bell. And I'll see y'all for more banger, banger, we some more banger content. So I'll see you the next time. Cheers for joining us out. And peace out, everyone.